I was out one evening alone, minding my own business. As usual, I was sitting alone in a very darkened corner of a bar, perusing what would be my night's prey. I am a walking freak to most, but figured I would have no worries as I hid from plain sight. I purchased a rather large pitcher of a dark ale, one of my favorite types of brew. I gathered up a pint glass from the barkeep who stared at me as I paid for my libation. That should have been a foretelling of what was to come. Soon I realized there was a minimal number of patrons and most were staring at me. My obfuscation seemed to have been blown. I quickly finished the pitcher and escaped into the night air. Within two blocks, it became increasingly obvious that I was being followed. I dashed into an alley and ran to the next block, all the while cloaking myself with the darkness. Last, there were four scoundrels who were in hot pursuit. I quickly slipped down a darker alley and clambered up a fire escape. I gathered the ladder up into its catch and waited. They passed underneath where I crouched, certain that they would see me. Tucked behind the ladder, I could hear what appeared to be my own loud breathing. What if they heard me above them? One of the men turned around and looked about. I was certain I would have to kill them all. They all began laughing and continued to the next block and disappeared. I was so thankful I could breathe normally again. But what would have happened if they had caught me? Then a sudden dawning came upon me. I am Scrog, the scourge of the seven seas, a vampire from the ages of pirates, a scoundrel who was at no need to breathe. Lucky for them, my libation had gotten the better of my mind that night. It allowed them to breathe one day more at least. <laughs> and remember, you never know who or what is lurking in the shadows. Breathless, be breathless, be so